Okay, for those of you who are absent today, welcome back to uh, Hope Spanish class. Hope you had a great Christmas. And so we're gonna start off with new vocabulary. We have actually 63 words and phrases that you need to learn. And you'll have a quiz every day this week. You'll have a quiz tomorrow, one through 15. You'll have a quiz on Wednesday, one through 30. You'll have a quiz on uh, Thursday, which is one through 40, just adding an additional 15 and then an additional 10. And then on Friday, uh, you have a quiz on 40 through 50 words and phrases. Make sure that you write down on a sheet of paper the vocabulary for the new story. The name of the story is called Cambio de Pelo. Cambio is exchange. Pelo means hair, right? You give me your hair, I give you my hair, okay? So, you probably should know one through four already. Here are, I'm gonna read all of these out to you. Numero uno, you're gonna go to DeepL and translate all this, right? There is a. Numero dos, his name is. Numero tres, he has, you're gonna draw a line, years, okay? Numero cuatro, he lives in. You should know all of those already, and you should be able to translate those right away. Some of you might know the, the rest. Hair, I just said it earlier, right? Number six, brown, brown, okay? When you type in brown in deep bell, type in brown hair. That's what I want you to type in, brown hair. Number siete is straight, okay, straight. I want you to type in straight hair. Because if you just put straight, it might come out different. Straight hair. You can even uh, type in uh, straight brown hair and see what you get. Eyes is, that's another one you should know. Very, you should also know. Those are easy, you should know those. Intelligent, ugly, handsome. Number 14 is lazy. Now you can pause, write, pause, write as you're listening to this, unless you need to zoom in. Number 15 is another. Number 16 is also. Number 17 is curly. On this one, I want you to put curly hair when you type it in. But all I want you to do is translate curly. See what you come up with. Number 18 is black. Number 19 is purple. Number 20 is problem. Number 21 is wants. You should know wants already. You should know to have already. Number 23 is like. But this word like is not like I like ice cream. That's a different kind of like. This like is a comparing. Uh, I want you to type in like him or like that one. But all I want translated is like, okay? It's gonna sound like a interrogativo, but no accent. That's number 23. Number 24, he thinks that you should know that. Right, you should know thinks already. That was in our last story. Uh, his hair, type in both words. That's number 25, his hair. Number 26, is normal. That is number 26, is normal or ordinary. Different. Number 28 is goes to a. Number 29 is expert in hair so goes to uh could be goes to a uh, expert in hair his name is his name is you should know that one he is very nice that's number 31 he is very nice number 32 goes to brazil number 33 
to the factory. Number 34 is to talk. Number 35 is he tells him. He tells him. You should have just two words for this. If you want to put el for he, you can. That would make it three words. I want to have. You should know I want. And you should know to have. Oh, here we go. Black curly hair. Black curly hair. Number 38 is I only have. Number 39 is red hair. You can even type that whole thing in. I only have red hair. What horror. We usually don't say that in English, but we do say it in Spanish. What horror. I'm sorry. There lives another. There lives another. Very ugly. We have ugly over here. We have very ugly. You should know that one. Once you write in ugly, you should know very very nice, right? Here we have nice. Number 45, I want to have, it's again, I want to have. Keep saying this. I only have, I only have, I only have blonde hair. Goes to 49 is because Number 50, they don't sell. You should know that one already. They don't sell. He has, you should know that, he has an idea. An idea is a cognate. Wants to talk with. You remember what a cognate is? It spells the same or very close to the same, and it has the same meaning, like doctor, and doctor, spelled the same in English as in Spanish, and it means the same thing in English and in Spanish. Okay, back to 52, wants to talk with. 53, can we exchange? Can we exchange? Yes, of course. Number 55, the reason I love your hair. It's a stronger word than like, right? I love your hair. He gives his hair, his hair ownership. They look funny. That's number 57. They look funny. Number 58. He is happy because, we have because written a couple of times. We have because here, because, and because. Okay. Number 58, again. He is happy because, 59, he is already handsome, 60, he is handsome also, number 61, he is very nice, he is very nice, don't type it in again, okay, you should know it by now, because, and the last one, number 63, he gives his hair. He gives his hair. Okay, 1 through 63. So tomorrow on Tuesday, today is the 8th, tomorrow is the 9th. You can have a quiz on 1 through 15. That's tomorrow. Okay. Adios. Good luck.